Well, I think we're, we're looking to improve from last year. Uh, we have a, a good amount of uh, young players, still young in our program, that had some experience as freshmen, particularly on defense, that uh, did a nice job as young players. We have to realize that they're still young. They're only sophomores, and there's a handful of them, plus some, that, um, that play a lot on defense, quote-unquote starters or regular players. And um, we still have to understand that they're – they're, they are sophomores. They're going to make mistakes. They're still going through their growing pains. And uh, we've got to be patient with that. And then on our offensively, um, you know, we have a little bit more uh, uh, experience at some of the skill positions with upperclassmen that we're hoping can elevate ourselves. Um, the offensive line would be a mixture of some returning players and some new players. So uh, we're hoping that we can get some continuity and some uh, coordination with that as, as the year goes on. Um, and then in the special teams area, we've got to vastly improve in our kickoff game. That's the area that was dramatically uh, put us in a hole with either uh, a short field for our opponent, which ultimately led to a long field for our offense. So we're looking for some, some gains in that area. I think you got to talk about Dustin Rock, Chris Rice, um, Luke Issa, Zach Policino, um Four guys off the top of my head that uh, played a lot, played regularly uh, when they were freshmen that are now back for their second year. I think you could add in Jason Gilsinger as a, as a fifth, um, who's been hampered a little bit with some preseason injuries, but is getting healthy and back to do that, to practice. So uh, those are the ones in particular. And uh, what about just like returning players or juniors who are now seniors kind of thing? like? Well, I think, uh, you know, on offense, uh, we've got Mitch Karen, we've got Ryan Berry, we've got Sam Lewis, we've got Mo Harris, um, excuse me, uh, John Hahn, who plays tight end for us. There's a lot in special teams. That uh, Those are the skill guys I was referring to earlier, with the exception of Sam Lewis at left tackle, that um, we're expecting big things from and hoping can make plays for us. Um, and then... Um, or defensively, Wyatt Prue has always been a solid player for us. Taylor Laramie is a defensive lineman, um, has been solid for us. Um, expecting a big year from Owen Treader, Ethan Sherwood, that are both in their senior years. So um, we've got a blend of some talent uh, players that uh, have some experience and some that need to get some experience. Uh, and you kind of talked about a little bit with, with Owen and, and Wyatt, but uh, replacing, obviously, Jacob Troutline, or mm. maybe not replacing, but trying to fill in where he left a big hole in the defense. Sure. Uh, great player. Uh, you know, Grant Cummings, uh, one that I failed to mention earlier, but uh, a captain for us, uh, an inside linebacker player, same position, same neighborhood that Jake played, that uh, we're expecting to try to fill that hole, uh, be that interior presence that can stop. Um, be, a, be a, a stopping force for our defense in that area um, and hoping that it can kind of spread throughout the defense uh, 